Yeah, I was about as on it as I could be. I, I could have maybe run a little bit faster, but... That is about as much as I have in me. Man, most of the uh, most of the field qualified. Yeah, so eleven positions up from my number, I'll take it. Yeah, I mean, I have faith that you can do better than your I rating or your car number. And yeah, strength of field is forty forty one. Just kind of. I figured it was close to what my I rating was, since I'm car fourteen. Yeah, but that is a high number. Yeah. I think yeah. that's gonna be the highest strength of field I've ever raced in, or uh, one of them. Oh, uh, really? Yeah. Yeah, I'm kind of to the point that that's in the time slots that I run, because I usually run when there's multiple splits. That usually ends up being my eye ratings at this point. Yeah, I got to that 31 number, had some bad races, got back up near the 31 number, had a couple bad races now. That's how it goes. Well, I wish I saved the replay from the truck race, because people were fucking jumping restarts right, so bad. Green next time, bye. All right, man, line up on the inside row. We put in plenty of fuel to finish the race. Yeah. It's all a draft track, so they were just laying back, throttling up before it went green, and like... Yeah, because only the front row is affected by the start zones. Well, but why are they allowed... Like, why does iRacing allow them to pass low? What are you talking about? So like some of the guys that jumped the restarts are passing below me on the on the apron. If they weren't, if they didn't actually completely complete the pass on you, then that's why. If they were ahead of you and passing you to the inside on the restart and were ahead of you at the line, it would black flag them. If they're side by side and just a tick behind you, it would not. Mm. So they were probably timing it so that they would not be. You have past two them. additional sets of tires for this race. Be smooth and have a good run. Stab the brake. Ugh, this one guy's using. He's back there with you. He's using the Clint Boyer 07 car, but it's the yep. Direct TV car. Like, why would you pick that scheme? Yeah, of all schemes, why do you pick that one? The Jack, Daniels. Jack Daniels car. Yeah, the Jack Daniels car was such a classic. Are you doing a, a dab of the brake? Yeah, usually. In the entry? Yeah. A dab or more trail brake? Eh. I'm not consistent enough. So it's probably more dab than full trail brake. Oh, there you go, you already had somebody disconnect. Finishing higher than my number. <laughs> Wonder how high I need to finish in this race to gain I rating. Mm, what car number are you, 24? 26 on the last on the grid. I would guess anywhere in the top 17 or 18 and you would gain. That's my prediction. 19th or worse, and you'll lose. So just maintain if you can. <laughs> yeah. Get ready. Like right now, the guy behind me is like... A league behind me. Yeah, I'll be... I'll be letting these guys go early. Green flag, green flag. Oh, see, already going to the apron below me. Stay low, Put me fucking three wide. Still there? Hold your line. Still there. I'm about to be three wide in the middle. No, the guy's gonna back out behind me. Stay low. Stay low, there's a car on the high side. Thank you. 
still there. You're clear high, clear high. The guy behind you is the one that jumped yeah, the one restart on me. Yeah. Still there. Stay low. You're clear high, clear high. All right. Now we just settle in. Definitely gotta save some tire, because you never know when a race like this will just go green. I can tell you that after like 15 to 20 laps, even if you're saving tire, it starts getting looser and looser. Yeah, one in fact. There. So just we'll be ready for that. Clear low, clear low. That's fun. Mm-hmm. That we just popped this lack of the fish. I don't think I'm driving too hard, but I just did a 30.9. I'm doing it. My best lap's a 30.7. Right at the little circular Vegas Motor Speedway logo enter in turn one and then a tick after the white line across the track. Yeah, you know, kinda like the yellow box. Yeah, that's right after the line. Yeah, it's pretty much where I am. The leader just did a thirty point seven one eight. Yeah, I mean the leader's already doing thirty point sevens. I did a 30.8 on my last lap. It'll probably take 15 to 20 laps until you start seeing comers and goers. If I were to guess. That bottom, those bumps are horrible. Yeah.
Holy dive bomb! Group in front of me is starting to have some people that are switching positions. This will be about where if someone was using their shit early. Kind of like you in that practice session where you'll, they'll start falling apart a little bit. Because I think we are 12 or 13 laps in in that race, or in that practice run. Leaders did a 31.35. Damn, I did a 31.453. I'm not far off of the leaders. I actually ran faster than the leader. Well, I'm also side by side. Yeah. Because I'm better than this guy in 1 2, but then he dive bombs the shit out of me in 3 4. I'll pill. He'll end up using his stuff up on you. More than likely. Be AI. If it goes green, hit it right at lap 40. What, dude? You gotta push me out of the way to get past me. I'm starting to close back in on these guys in front of me. Push me out of the way, just ran into the wall. Inside. Still there. Clear low, clear low. The lead is just a 31.848. It's amazing that you're only a tenth off the leader and you're like 18th. Uh, well, I'm in the you wall. wall. Yeah, guy. In front of me got into it's it clear also. High. Clear high. Entry there. Oh, that guy. <laughs> Workman's 
work in it. You're showing honor, courage, and commitment. Yeah, he's one of the guys that blew past me early. Yeah. Starting to uh, get squirrely down the streets. Yeah, it is. Car one has taken the lead. Got one outside. Still there. Still there. All clear, all clear. I definitely have not practiced uh, green flight pit stops like that. Uh, Federico up here in the 15 car is the one I was having an issue passing earlier that keeps getting into the wall and stuff. There's a white car on the outside. Oh, the 4th of July car that was started in front of me? No, he's in just an iRacing car. Oh. Uh, 4th of July car is like six cars ahead of you. I'm just keeping an eye on my line at this point. I can't. I just see the red bumper. The lead is just did a 32.067. Outside. I did not hit touch him. You're clear high, clear high. You got one outside. But I was headlining okay. it, trying to make sure he wasn't going to come down and get me. Stay low. Ooh. Still there. Hold your line. Hate the straightaway right now. Still there. Hold your line. Car four has taken the lead. Stay low. There's a car on the high side. You're clear high. Clear high. Outside. All clear, all clear. Yeah, one inside. Still there. All clear, all clear. Inside. Stay high. Still there. Hold the line. Stay high. Ooh. There's a car on the low side. Still there. Hold the line. Clear low. Clear low. Inside. Ooh, your eye rates are blinking. Stay high. Still there. Clear low, clear low. Inside. Clear low, clear low. Inside. Stay high. There's a car on the low side. Clear low, clear low.
both these guys are getting deep in the corner. And the lead is just did a 32.159. I'm always about a tenth off of what the leaders run. I'm running 15th. Got a right front tire warning out warning. Fine. Yeah. It's probably your right rear. Right here, I can't take this anymore. I can't take it anymore. <laughs> I'm getting right front warnings. How are guys that are driving deeper than me get? You don't know if they are. Well, that's true. Because I mean, we're pitting in what? Like two laps anyway? I'm on pit road now. Five laps. How are you? Yeah. Start with the previous night. Five, four, three, two. I want to pit, but the guy behind me is like. Yeah, that was the thing. Oh I had a clear gap behind me, so I decided to just go ahead and do it. That was 56.48. Alright, that's I'm it. I'm in the go. 30s, so I'm getting a warning. Nah, it's 50% where that comes in. Be mindful, you only have one set of cars remaining. 26 is going to be hitting this time. The fuck you are! Our 
front is pitting. Forty. Thirty-three. Yeah. Turn front is pitting. All right, man. Halfway this time by. That was your boss's lap of the session. That car is a lap down. Damn you and your undercooks. Go catch me. I literally just did it because I was like I had enough pace to pass the person in front of me but I didn't want to do it and then immediately have to hit. So I just went ahead and did it. Are you lifting in the tri-oval? Yeah, one inside. Uh, ideally, no. Clear low, clear low. But sometimes you got to. No, I was only asking because I was wondering how I burned up my... Right, here's so much. Four, nine, four. I mean, you're... Tire wear was a pretty even split compared to mine. Cutting the time. Like, we were both more worn on the right rear. Your percentages were just overall lower than mine, but I also hit a couple laps after you. You're pulling away from the car behind. The gap is 1.8 outside. All clear, all clear. Put it in, put it in, put it in. 46. That guy's pitting in, FYI. I'm still running high, I'm not running that low line. Car yeah. 19 has taken the lead. Pit again. Pitting, pitting. Definitely some people out here running it dry. how I'm like lapping this guy in front of me, he must have sped or something. guys that are going to be driving back up through the field some that ran it completely dry. You guys have blocked the other guy all the way down the fucking back straightaway. Like that six cars on six lap pressure tires at me. It's back there with you. Which isn't a ton, but it's enough. Oh, 
They are all driving in deeper than me because they almost just ass packed me. Six, nine, eight. There you go, man. You're doing real good. Keep hitting your mark. It actually liked it better. Yeah, I mean, we're in the right front a little bit more. It may not hurt. get extremely loose multiple times. All clear, all clear. Got a guy on fresh sheets coming. Seven car. By freshies, you mean 10 mile bull tires? Yep. Oh, and he just got me loose.
people are putting air on my left rear and it's making me so loose. Go ahead, bud. That is a gaggle of cars back there. Yeah, it is. Thank you. Might as well learn something. Definitely doesn't like it if you get up off the bottom in three and four. Yeah, not anymore. Earlier in the race it was pretty fine, but right now it's They put me three wide right now. <laughs> yeah, it's the problem for you now is you're just on that much older tires that I'm just gonna eat you up. Well, I mean, I have no problem getting past and letting guys go, but none of these guys are patient right now. Big time loose on the floor. That was my smoke that you were driving through. <laughs> <laughs> These guys should put their nose on that left rear and around she wants to go. 31.961. Still there. 
Still there. Stay high, there's the car on the low side. Still there. Stay high. Stay high. You're up top three wide. Oh, no, I'm three Hold wide. Your Hold your line. Hold your line. Inside, you're too wide there. Come on, Stay I can high. Clear low, clear low. All right, man, caution is out. Clear. Caution is out. Line up single file. Get road is closed. What? Not you right hook me into the wall and say not clear. Alright. Don't. Don't move. It's the 20 car. Pit road is now open. 25, I need you to catch up. I'd like to pit. of fucking optional repairs. I'll probably drive decent. That's it, go! Who are your tires on that one? Just get the charge. Make them last the rest of the right. Line up single file. Uh, 6455. Yeah, I'm over. I'm so overdriving it then. I'm 5249. Tire split was better than mine. Well, now it's gonna just be uh, Bond's eye driving, so. There's gonna be zero saving at this point. The wheel's cocked to the right. Is it normal? Uh, yeah, I mean, it's to some extent down the straight unless you put an offset in. No, I didn't do. I didn't touch anything besides the fourteen to one. Yeah, that's probably normal. That guy is We're driving in the grass. Is yeah, he cool on his tires? Oh, yeah. Easy, Chad. Yeah, I just, as soon as it went black, I just tried to pull it down there. I didn't mean to go on the grass, but that's what happened. Ah, oh, okay. It's, he's got Scott Tompkins issue. Yep. I guess pulling it in the grass is better than running into a bunch of people. Yeah, it makes sense why you did that. <laughs> it looked a little goofy at first. Yeah, it went black, and I, I reached up to, like, it just went black and then turned right back on. I don't know, it was weird. Alright, well, I'm gonna have to 
Drive qualifying laps now, Scotty. Realistic, yeah, realistically, there's going to be a wreck more than likely. Yeah, the guy in my spotter, Chris, I raced with, said that I caused that wreck. He said I came down on him, but it felt like he came up on my nose. I mean, right, man, we're going green next depending on where it was, right, you're man, probably so loose that, road. yeah, it wouldn't surprise me if you were moving down, so. But, I mean, he was the one that, like, pushed me up the track earlier in the race anyway, so I don't feel bad. I have a feeling the 41 on your outside, Federico, is going to lay back like he did on the initial start and jump everything and wreck. That's not Federico's the guy to your inside, the guy behind No, me. so that's Matt Snall, yeah. It's literally Stallneck. <laughs> Nullneck? Stallneck? T is probably something. Get ready. Guy behind you in first gear. Good for him. Alright, man. The pace car is in. Green, green, green. The lead is just a 1 minute 31.431. I just want to avoid the wreck at this point. Yeah, one inside. Still there. Five left to go. Stay high. You're up top three wide. Yeah, one inside. Two wide there. Clear low, clear low. Get okay. Stay high. He took no tires on that one. Stay high. Still there. Hold your line. He's about to get his ass wrecked. Get with your boxes left of the fish. Still there. The car is C3. Just hit the box of left. 29.942. Still there. Still there. That was your box is left of the fish. Stay high, here's the car on the low side. Stay high. Clear low, clear low. Got one inside. Stay high, clear the car on the low side. Stay high, clear low, clear low. Two left to go. But I'm definitely damaged in some sorts. Left of the fish. Outside. Still there. Still there, towards the line. Stay low, there's a car on the high side. You got the bottom three wide. Outside, two wide there. Stay low. All clear, all clear. You got one outside. All right, man. White flag. One more left. Go. Stay low. There's a car on the high side. The lead is just did a 30.217. Still there. Still there. What's the line? Still there. Wrecking. Yeah, it's not wrecking enough to get me any spots. Oh, well. I'm sorry, Larry. I couldn't react to that. That's not bad, man. 
Alright, well, I got Frederico. Federico. Right, Matthew, who uh, threw a here. massive block going down the back on me, I uh, couldn't get back around. You're right, good one. That was, uh. Spun fun. You threw the field there, Chad. That was some, uh. White knuckle yeah, racing in the last six laps. I couldn't keep up. These cars are just intense in a pack on this track. Yeah, well, we're yeah. gonna you're gonna find out because didn't I say you need yeah, to finish 18th or better to gain or not lose? So let's see what. Find out. Yeah. I probably gained a minuscule amount. I was probably in like the position I needed to. I'm loose. Huh? No, I'm looking at the replay. Way to go on that caution, Scott. Larry Pace just messaged me. Larry Pace, the guy who probably got screwed. Yeah, he he was the one car. He was the one that was leading, so that caution probably really hurt him. I said, "Oh well, I am." The, oh, I said, "Oh well, I am the twenty-six car." Take the high road, Scott. I don't know. See, I feel like I'm up high. I will like, give I'm you. I'm loose, but I'm holding my line. I'm like on my line. Well, you're already damaged there. When did? When was it? Lap sixty-nine. The best. Yeah. I mean, the actual answer is it was netcode. Oh, he just so he's dissing me, and then he disconnects. So he goes, um, "Not an excuse. Be better. You didn't even realize it was your fault. Ruined a great race for seventeenth. You need to know your own limitations." Yeah, I mean, Be it, it was netcode. Is what the initial contact was. I mean, yeah, I'm loose, but I'm holding my line. To how I what I feel like anyway. I gotta look at it from another view, but yeah, I mean it's not really that big a deal. No, it's not. But I mean, it's like welcome. That's to the things I hate about officials. Welcome to top split racing, Scott. Be better. Yeah. Be better.